freshman by two Steve freshmen the center and Steve the tailback. The center and the tailback. Dylan. Hand off the hand off the jump. Sometimes you know, the rhythm, you'll, you'll get false starts. Rhythm, you'll get false starts. So on second and twelve. So on second and twelve. Brown tension with one hand. Brown tension with one hand. Catch on the snap. Catch on the snap. Catch on the snap. Check out. He lost a check out. He lost a shoot. Davon Jones steps in now. Davon Jones steps in now. The Frank Leahy Bowl is up for grabs in this one. On first down and ten, Boston College with great field position. Able three tight ends are going to be a big part of this BC offense today. Two tight ends are in there now. Here's A.J. Dillon. He's as a true freshman. On second down and four. It's Dillon, and he has the first down. Ooh, this could be really good. We'll see what they are today. On first down and ten. There's Dillon taking some people. On an 11 at the Notre Dame 31. And the handoff to Hilleman. And he's going to be put downs here. You go for it on fourth down if you don't get it all here. Wow, quick out to the far side. Got him the first down. Just an easy, safe throw to the outside. For Notre Dame, that's 20. College turned it over four times last week. Led directly to 21 points for Wake Forest. See, they can take advantage of getting it back on third and 14. Hilleman out of the back. Give to Dillon. Not much there. Round to throw. Get a pretty price. We open up quarter number two. Hand off right side. It's Hilleman. Hilleman with a good burst. Still on his feet. Cross midfield. 29. That's BC's biggest gain of this afternoon. Give it to him again. Feed him. Hilleman rough on the defensive line. They're coming right out of the hole. There's that Eagles tempo. They're able to slow Hilleman. Their offense has really struggled. Hand off. Hilleman. Since today, they recovered it, and he just fumbled it after he was down there. Dylan out. Hilleman in. But it's Brown to throw. And Brown to complete in the end zone. It's hard play action, and Callanan just runs a post route on the outside. You can see the defensive back looking in the backfield. Expect that's offense, defense, and special teams coming in. That snap a bit hot. That tells you you got to throw the ball. Here's Brown throwing. Kobe White. Be different. On third down and eight. Brown is 10 of 12. Been impressive so far. On first down and 10. It's Hilleman the ball. Dazio. He took credit for that one, and he's been impressive so far. Out to Third and five. On first down. Hilleman. Got some running room. He'll lower these. Quickly approaching 100 yards on the ground. Off the play fake. Brown to throw. And. Second and ten. A hand off to Hilleman. Brown with a nice pocket. There's Brown. Throwing. Both quarterbacks making just their third collegiate start today. So they have that in common. Here's Hill. Prior to the half, weren't able to do anything with it. Let's see what they do here. On the ground, and Hilleman. A.J. Dillon, but he has been the workhorse. He's over 100 yards on the afternoon. Takes a sh Quick screen out to Travis Levy. They call to keep field goal in the equation, not a turnover. Brown rolling to his right, throwing across his body, and back trying to set up. Especially Petrula, the true freshman playing at center as well. Here's Brown, buying some time and throwing all the... We've seen uh, Anthony Brown under center a little bit more. It's Dylan, the ball carrier. John Baker comes back. He's got another year left if he wants the redshirt year. That throw, tight ends, in for Boston College. And they hand it off to Hilleman. Able to make the stop. Look at the defensive tackle, that's Tung Vailoa Mosa. Great penetration into the bedroom, the guys up front in front seven. Both defenses have been outstanding today. Here's Brown throwing deep. And did he... Dollars in damage in Texas. Gonna take a long time to figure out the devastation that Irma caused. 
Our hearts still go out to all those people. Great cause to support. You've already helped out once. Do it again if you can. They're second and four. And a game. So that last touchdown to go up by 15 was huge. Brian Kelly would love to not have to answer that question <laughs> post game here. Honest and truthful, and I felt like he was. It's I think this is genuine. You see this incomplete pass here on second. Being genuine and honest when he says that they have done that. Here's third and six. Brown trying to get out of there. Got across to midfield. Been able to get Brandon Wimbush on the ground, and that's been the difference in the game. Here's Brown, all sorts of time. Not a whole lot of urgency by Boston College at this point. Here's Brown, throwing and completing. They have four out of their next six games are against top 16 opponents. That's how difficult the ACC has gotten. Thrown as he was hit. It's in the school here, it's, it's a challenge. In a very tough market. That is, is a pro sports town yes. <laughs> like hey come on in the ACC we'll <laughs> we'd love to have you for a while here schedule is right and they're on the wrong side of the ACC yes. when you look 15 years or so it's Dylan again I mean I think Anthony Brown is going to be a solid quarterback AJ Dillon at the tailback spot on the day Down as a sack. Round of throw. Got a man. And he's got a touchdown. Starts at the nine. Their worst field position of the day. Well documented. With a great starting field position. Really haven't been able to take advantage of that. Right now on the offensive side. Brown steps up and throws. And It's a crazy college football season. Oh, glad to see him get up. Off the draw, Brown hands to Hilliman. He struck from behind, and Notre Dame has it. It's Very nearly had a, and maybe should have had a, uh, his foot was out of bounds, a fifth rushing touchdown. Impressive. Team Brandon Wimbush be great tonight, but the other player is Lamar Jackson tonight against Clemson. Poorly thrown ball. Brown's worst throw of the day. Notre Dame has really turned up the heat here in the...